All that I have, I share with you, including our Valerie. <laughs> I think Dad's still got a soft spot for Diane. He's obviously devastated. Pour him with it. Within the love of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. No single malt, Rodney. You are slipping. Go away. Look, he won, you lost. Now go back down there and congratulate them, unless you want to make it obvious. I don't need to with you following me like a yapping hound. Hounds don't yap. You'd know. You've treated me like dirt. I'm sorry. Liar. In the presence of God and before this congregation, Diane and Jack have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. We did it. Touch and go there for a minute. Come on then, squeeze in. Go on, Ashley. Lovely bit tighter. Definitely colon. Vivian. Well, if Sharon Osborne can get over it, she'll be right. And cheese. Cheese. Better go and say sorry. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to kill that kid of mine, I tell you. She certainly knows how to hold a crowd. Oh, yeah. If you need to talk, you know that Zach's been through it all. Oh, there's a conversation made in heaven. My backside and his testicle. <laughs> <laughs> now, don't lose your rag. But three days ago, Rodney told me he was still in love with me and tried to get me to run off to Egypt. <laughs> what? Well, fortunately, I laughed too, so all's well that ends well. Poor Val. Aren't you even jealous? Well, if we hadn't just got married. <laughs> <coughs> the buffet is now open. Thanks, love. <laughs> I'd uh, give it a minute if I were you. Say things. I could say a lot of things, Rodney. I could definitely say one thing. Still wouldn't make you honest. Oh, and I suppose Diane is. You know, add it to the list. So it's honest to you, want is it? Not today, thank you. Voice beneath foghorn level. Go ahead, do your worst. There's nothing you can say. There is, Rodney. So shut up. Was you'd like to do the honours? If it means getting this show on the road and up to the reception, a flaming well will. Diane's got something to tell you. Oh, not so straight up now, eh? Paul, meet your father, Rodney Blackstock. You must be very proud. You liar! Oh, shut up. At least you can share makeup. Did you know? I'm afraid so. Oh! What did you do that for? Birthday cards, Christmas presents. Leaving me with Joan Crawford here. He didn't know either, love. Mother, you're a complete cow. That's what men do to you. And I've been called a lot worse. I don't know you at all, do I? It wasn't my fault. Never is, is it? Dinner gong's gone, folks. Off we go. You're my wedding singer. I can't. I saw Jimmy Pepper last year. <laughs> Massive flap and a slap over down to there. I know it's an appalling way to find out, but at least you don't have that to look forward to. <laughs> Come on now, up to the pub. What about me? You're on your own now, Val. You next, and don't bother sending us an invite. Oh. How about a milky coffee and a game of cards at yours? You like them when you get to know them. Emmerdale will be right back. Elf. <laughs> Completely inappropriate joke about illegitimate kids. Oh. <laughs> Wish I'd seen a clairvoyant before I wrote this, eh? Hello, Ashley Thomas. Anyway, there are lots of things I could say about Diane. Like, she always makes me laugh, and she's never made me cry. Well, apart from a little bit today in church. 
but I love you to bits. And more importantly, so does my dad. So everyone, to my dad and Diane. Dad and Diane! Diane. <laughs> well, you know what I mean. Hey, congratulations. Diane, I've got some news.